Port Key Games presents Hogwarts Legacy. Press X to start book two. Build version one 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 five nine four six. Now I'm playing. What's good, y'all? We here episode two, but ain't really episodes. It's kind of just a stream, live stream. Just watch me play through it, man. Just a full out play through in it, man. I'm so excited. I love the way this started off. The prelude, everything was perfect, man. Um. If you're new to the channel, please make sure you drop a like and subscribe. Um, and hit that bell notification game, noti gang. You already know what what type of time we on book squad. Stand up, we in this thing. First day of class. Oh, we got multiple characters. That's nice. Let's continue. This What's way. She... Okay. Why the she started giving running? Opportunities to practice your magic and educate yourself about wizarding law. Okay. Oh, they got a chest. I certainly would have appreciated something like the field guide when I was a student. Using the guide points. will also train you to be alert to your surroundings. Do keep up. Spoil you. Oh, my fault, my fault. I ain't gonna use my wine no more. Sorry, Professor. Look at the apple on the way. <laughs> Simply cast Revelio on it, and we'll see what the guide says. Revelio. Field guide page. House Elf Recipe Book Guide Pages, rumored to contain some of Helga Hufflepuff's. Original creation, this book holds a collection of Hogwarts students' favorite recipes over the centuries. Some dishes like pickled durable plums are likely to acquire an acquired taste. Okay, that's fine. The field guy. Okay, so we press pause to open this bit. Okay, we open it up. Now we see we got challenges, collection. Okay, I'll just open this first. Okay, field pages. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Okay, Clever, but we're still gonna look. All right, so we got a level at the top. We got the map. Let's check out the map. Okay, so right now we only can look at. Oh, this is what Quidditch just played. We only can look at Hogwarts right now, which I know that ain't just a map. They got a Hogsmeade world map. And a Hogsmeade map. Okay, we'll see that later. Um, quests. True, true, true. I'll post settings. Collections, inventory, and gear. Let's see what we got, man. We got any handware? I don't want nobody to see these gloves. Bitch, we serious book, man. Uh, face wear. Keep my goggles on. Oh, yeah. Let me get my gold shit. Or oh, silver room. These are more valuable. Cannot upgrade. I'm gonna keep this. I'm gonna keep these on just cause it's right there. Headwear. What we go with? This cap. No cap. <laughs> Neckwear. Scarf. I don't need that though. So health, defense, and offense. I got that. Okay. So cloaks. Traditional school robe and outfit. Nothing. Okay, wands, my and broom, all that shit is locked. Okay, that's fine. All right, let's head out. Keep your eyes open for more opportunities like that, inside and outside of the castle. Got you. What we got, Teach? Oh, unicorn. Ah, good timing. Perfect opportunity to show you how to use flu flames to get around a bit quicker. Your field guide contains a map of the castle. Open it up and find Central Hall. Flu flames are fast travel shit. Okay. Touchpad opens the map. Left side of the map where students and professor live. And the Great Hall. Okay. It's like the Great Hall, reading. 
Okay. Flu flames. Okay. And here we are, quite the time saver. These stairs lead directly to Central Hall. You can get almost anywhere in the castle quickly from Central Hall. Always something happening here. It's the heart of the hive, our King's Cross Station, so to speak. That should be all for now. You'll be expected to attend both Charms and Defense Against the Dark Arts classes today. And I'd like to be sure you get to Hogsmeade as soon as possible to replace the supplies you lost on the way here. You mentioned Hogsmeade, Professor. Hogsmeade is the only all-wizarding village in Britain and is home to an array of shops and pubs. You should be able to find all of the school supplies you require in Hogsmeade. You will also, I imagine, enjoy many a butterbeer there with friends in due course. What will I learn in charms class? Exactly what you might expect. Spells, charms, jinxes, all terribly useful. I think you will enjoy Professor Ronan. He's a clever and entertaining wizard and a talented teacher. Can you tell me more about the Defense Against the Dark Arts class? Defense Against the Dark Arts, as the name implies, focuses on how to defend oneself against the evils that lurk beyond these walls. A mastery of Defense Against the Dark Arts is required for those who aspire to become Auras. Fortunately, we are lucky to have the ever-gifted Professor Hecate in charge of our students' education in that regard. Perfect, perfect. My second fellas and, my, and girls or whoever watching. Um, but I had to get some water. Thank you, <clears throat> Professor Weasley. A lot to absorb on your first day, and you have much to learn. Happily, your professors have agreed to create additional assignments for you outside of class. You'll be up to speed in no time. Judging by your adept use of Revelio earlier, I'd say Professor Fig succeeded in at least showing you the basics. He did, Professor. He's been terribly vague as to the events preceding your arrival, specifically about what happened after that awful dragon attack. My suspicion is that there's more to the story than a search for belongings and an extended trip up to the castle. I'm sorry, Professor, but I'm afraid that's all there is to it. Hmm. Almost precisely what Professor Fig said. Speak of the devil, Professor Fig. Your ears must have been burning. Oh? Yes. You seem to have provided our new fifth year with a solid foundation in the basics of spellcasting. Ah, I'm afraid I can't take all the credit there, Professor. They've a rare aptitude for magic, it seems. Hmm. Well, I'm just glad you both arrived in one piece. Perfectly good boats and carriages to Hogwarts, and you chose to fly in the path of a dragon. I wouldn't say I chose the dragon's path, Professor. Rather unfortunately, it would seem that it chose us. Very well. Enough chit-chat. I need to get to class myself. Might I rely on you, Professor Fig, to explain the details of the field guide's map? Of course. Thank you. Good luck today. And remember to use your field guide. It will be invaluable to you. And invaluable to me, as I'll be using it to keep up to date on your progress. Yes, Professor. Come oh, so you're watching me. Come in my classroom after you've attended both classes today, and I'll explain more about those assignments I mentioned. And we'll see if we can't get you to Hogsmeade for those supplies. All right. I couldn't rat out my dual professor, man. It's good to see you, professor. And you. I was hoping our paths would cross today. 
before you immersed yourself in studies. Did I hear you masterfully evade Professor Weasley's interrogation regarding our late arrival? I did my best, but I'm fairly certain she suspects that we're not being entirely forthcoming. Yes, well, Professor Weasley is a brilliant and astute mm. witch. It was right to keep the details to yourself for now. We don't know where this path we've embarked upon will lead. It may require a bit more flexibility with your time than she would approve of. And she may feel obliged to share details with the headmaster that would be better left between us. Understood, Professor. Good. Now, as capable as you are, I believe the ability you possess obliges you to be well-trained. Happily, you have the benefit of an exceptionally skilled team of witches and wizards to guide you. Speaking of guides, and so that I may avoid another not-so-subtle reproof from Professor Weasley, why don't I show you the clever enchantment we included in the field guide's map? Unfold it and have a look. Okay. Press. Let me see. The map is enchanted to help you find your way. This will be incredibly helpful. Thank What's you. up, Cleve? Now, like Shout out to Cleve in the chat, ahead. man. What with classes and a trip to Hogsmeade for supplies, including your own wand, you'll enjoy. Ruin Leon in the thing, man. An exceptional craftsman. I'm a. Uh, How's I'll Hufflepuff, man? Check when I have more information about our mysterious I did my quiz, and that's now, the house I was on in the quiz. Classes and pay attention. More than your owls may hinge on the magic you are able to master within these walls. I'm the greatest, man. Hating ass, Nick. Cast Charmed Compass. Oh, that's what's up. Slytherin gang. Fuck Slytherin. I'm gonna see if I can jump over there. I don't think I could. Where are we going? Ain't nowhere no test could be at. I guess I go the right way for right now. Hmm? I hope I'm going the right way. I'm in big ass school. Matter of fact, I'm just about to you heard me. Huh. And I ain't not like none of them bitches. Okay, that's fine. We gonna, we gonna just follow the map at the bottom. Too Ugh. afraid to fight you. Ha. Who keep playing with me? <laughs> Push that up. Push it up. I'm trying to hit it. Ah, it was this door. Nice. Oh, look outside, man. I love this shit, though. It, it reminds me so much about the, uh... Oh! What the hell? I ain't drawing no goddamn Slytherin, bruh. Defense against the Dark Arts Tower, Flu Flame. I got the hose over there. You can't imagine how inconvenient travel was before I invented flu powder. Why are they going hard? Oh, it's upstairs. I gotta start looking at the map. I keep running. I keep running without looking at the map because I'm excited and shit. Let me go where I'm supposed to go. Oh! I could never go to Hogwarts because I feel like there's too much shit definitely going on. So 
Of us they said we ain't fucking with their wires, yeah. <laughs> All right. Here, behind you, Natasha. There is an open seat here. Thank you. Hello. I knew they were black. Betty. So you are the new student. Have you met Professor Ronan yet? <clears throat> Shall we begin? <laughs> Welcome to year five of chant. <coughs> now, this will be a crucial year in your education on the art of charm work. But I am confident that we will take hold with a passion and rigor requisite of such a challenge. Right now, everyone, please open your textbooks to page 517. But before we begin, can anyone here tell me the difference between the incantations of the Color change and growth charms. Anyone? Anyone? Oh, I could. Uh, 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 I am afraid it is too late to study now. Hmm. My, the summer months. See, she be getting me caught, man. <laughs> By the looks of it, you all spent your holidays practicing obliviate on one another. <laughs> uh, hmm. Do you? Even remember how to perform a basic summoning charm. Hmm? Mm, no. Hmm. Well, it seems that we are in dire need of review. Everyone get into pairs and take positions on opposite sides of the classroom. Now let's put those textbooks to use as the blunt objects you so believe they are and take turns summoning them out of one another's hands. Only one book will be needed per partnership, Miss Dale. Thank you. Get into place now. So this is called Accio. I'm gonna say Accio. Let me see. All right. Got him. Got him. Akio. Akio. Get your boy. That is not bad. Is that a not you bad? Is you from Wakanda? Wakanda? I see a lot of potential, but remember, potential is nothing without practice. Mm. Keep at it. You might just rival Miss Onai here. Very good, everyone. That's enough of that. Thank you, Raz. Putis is pronounced exceptionally lovely day. Axio. All right, all right, all right. Ourselves a little excursion outside for Appreciate a spot of fresh air. After me. Ah. <sighs> I've always found that fun goes hand in hand with mastery, as I'm sure the Quidditch players amongst us would agree. Hmm? <laughs> so, what better than a bit of sport to put our prowess with the summoning charm to the test, <laughs> right? <laughs> Why you want to be so evil? <laughs> oh, look at him! I need this when I play art. <laughs> So why don't we have our newest students start us off? Hmm? What am I supposed to do? <laughs> Very simply, cast a the summoning charge. The spheres, and the Akio pulls your charm the target closer the to cast your whole R2 and now, press the assigned button to cast Akio if you will. But and pull the target the closer. Out, press the button again to cast it. The trick is to pull the sphere as far as possible, but not a bit more, or it'll fall. Yes? Akio, I could keep talking of excellent control there. That's it! Ah! Happens to the best of us. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. Talk to me nice. Not All right. Worry. Okay. Okay. Very good. Points to Hufflepuff. Points to Hufflepuff. Certainly no sport in playing without some friendly competition. 
Now I'm competitive. You care to give our new student a bit of a challenge? Come on up. You'll be the blues just as before, and Miss Onai, you are playing red. Clear? Yes, sir. Come on, serious. Go ahead, ladies first. Ladies first. Damn. Talk to me. Oh, damn. Boy, she is a dog. I don't know. Merlin might have been slithering. What's up, Nilo? Nilo K7. Come on. Man, what's going on? Oh, yeah, she swept me. This just started my villain arc. <laughs> Let's make this a bit more interesting, shall we? And she had more balls than me. <laughs> I think we are well past interesting at this point. Let me go first. I'll say. Enough chatter. Focus now. You. Oh, what you trying to walk it. up over here for, girl? This round settles it all. What's this? Trash, trash, come on. Yes. Somebody says swish and flick. Swish and flick, swish and flick. Come on, man. Well played. <laughs> all right, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right. All right. Come on, Natty. I'm going to call you Natty. You ready? You ready? Ha! Let's go, baby. That's double 30s, though. I'm looking like Curry. Come on. Game winner. <gasps> Come ball game, ball game, ball game, ball game. That's a game winner right there, fellas. Very good, both of you. Well done. We tied up, so all I gotta say is the tiebreaker is gonna be crazy whenever we get back to it. Good game back there. I must admit, I think I underestimated you. Took me yep. weeks to become proficient with Akio. Took weeks for me to get anything right when I transferred here. It gets easier, I promise. Thank you, but I've been holding my own. I appreciate your confidence. I transferred here from Wagadu just before. Wagadu? That says a you. My That's mother a you. received an offer to teach divination here. Before I knew it, we had left Uganda and were halfway around the world at a new school in a new country. How big is Wakanda? Is Wagadu much bigger than Hogwarts? <laughs> Wagadu School of Magic is the largest wizarding school in the world. So, yes bigger than hogwarts but it never seemed intimidating or overwhelming to me it always felt like home mm. 
For some reason, I kind of don't care about Owagadu. It's nice to learn about another wizarding school. Thank you for asking. I do miss Wagadu, but I am glad to be here at all. <laughs> <laughs> ah, I think Putis. Professor Ronan wants to talk to you. She gonna steal Let a kidney. Keep him waiting. Until all next we time. gotta say is, I'm a, I'm gonna cast my Patronus so she don't get close. You can use Akio on humans. A word if you're if so you would. Blind. Well, Wait, you'd be kidding. using it on clothing, to be precise, Sebastian. You know it won't work on humans. So it don't work on humans, but these Slytherins, y'all up to no good. I see y'all. Yeah. What's up, teacher? You wanted to speak with me, Professor? I did. I trust your first charms lesson lived up to expectation? Well, an outdoor competition wasn't exactly the lesson I was expecting, sir. What charm is there in the expected? You did well, managing to best as gifted a student as Miss Onai. Thank you, Professor. I enjoyed the match. Miss Onai is always a fierce competitor, though I sense that she is a bit distracted of late. <clears throat> now, Professor Weasley has asked that. that your professors give you instruction outside of the ordinary curriculum. Expect to hear from me soon regarding a special assignment that I am preparing for you. Gotcha. First class student. Charms class is done. I got a three o'clock class over there. The Ministry of the Dark Arts. Hello there. You're the new student, aren't you? Oh, what you want, girl? Let me see. Samantha? Hello. You wanted to speak to me? Samantha Dale. I've been eager to meet you. You're the student everyone's been whispering about. Hope your first day is going well. You certainly seem to hold your own in charms. I've been fortunate. Beginner's luck. <laughs> My brother yeah, William man. would tell you not to be so humble and to trust your abilities. Then again, he tends to be overconfident in his. Well, better see to my charms homework. I'm afraid I can't count on beginner's luck to impress Professor Ronan. Yeah, don't try it. Often imitate and never duplicate it. Okay, so. It looks like they got some food for me. No. Look at the cat. I'm going to pet the cat. Why are we so close on this dude's face? Come on, man. So this is the Ravenclaw common room or something? I don't know. Man, who the heck? Fight, fight. It's a bold attack. Was the minister a boot or the minister a flat? Stop it, Peeves, you'll get us in trouble. In trouble you will be, but you can't get Peeves a smack. She says it's a boo, and he says it's a flat. Peeves, enough. What you'll get us all on? detention. Hey, look, y'all go here and get in trouble if y'all want. It was Hephaestus Gore. Y'all can get in trouble if you want. I'm going to just go ahead and handle my business and go to class. Where we go? Oh, it's this way? <laughs> Would y'all would have liked if they would have had like Daniel Radcliffe come and be like Harry Potter, like the headmaster or something like that and pay him for this? Because I mean, to be honest, no matter what movie or whatever he go to, he's going to always be known as Harry Potter, no matter what. So he might as well just capitalize off of it and make all the money he can make. I don't know what y'all think. That would have been cool. But I like they got like a Weasley in here, huh? You know, kind of keep it a little bit like we just a different generation. Got the rhino. All right, dark arts class. A lot of cadavers so fast. Oh. Man, they going crazy in here. you'd be good enough to blast each other to pieces in your own time. I get new students every year, but I only have one Hebridean black skull. It was a token from the great poacher raid of 1878. No doubt you've heard of it. Now, 
You may be asking yourself how an old woman like me single-handedly took out the largest poacher ring in Eastern Wales and lived to boast about it. Knowledge. Damn. To the wise, age matters very little. Today we will review a spell that has saved me from the hands of dark wizards more times than I care to remember. Not Leviosa. A levitation charm. Levioso. A surprised opponent is a weak opponent. Care to defend yourself, Master Pruitt? No? One thing I've learned as an unspeakable is the value of simplicity, especially in the heat of battle. Now, let's practice what we've just learned, starting with something small. Okay, before I start this, fellas, um, isn't like the dark arts teacher always bad in Harry Potter or something? Like, doesn't something always bad happen to them? So let's let's watch out for that. Anyway, steady your wand. Rem Guardium Levios. Levioso. Now, let's try something a little larger. She cheating. Oh, I want my costume to look like that. I love a hood and a cape. Me? Let us begin with the basic cast. See how the dummy deflected your cast. This time, cast Levioso first, then the basic cast. Okay. Remember, a surprised opponent is a weak opponent. What the fuck? Master oh. Pruitt, so art. Let me help. So, now the basic cast. Well done. Okay. Okay. Very good. But the best way to practice is by dueling. We'll start with you two. Duelists, take your marks. Was that Efron? Now, I want a fair duel using only Levioso, basic cast, and Protego. You may begin. Sit down, Sebastian. Come on. Let's just say I'm a quick learner. Oh, I forgot how to do it. Get off me. Got him. Oh, get off the table, boy. Not bad for a beginner. You give as good as you get. Okay. See you later, Zach Efron. I put you on the spot, and you rose to the challenge. Points to Hufflepuff. Thank Points you, to Professor. Hufflepuff. Glad to have the opportunity to practice. If what I've seen today is any indication, we can expect great things from you. I demand excellence from my students. They are capable of achieving it, and they must achieve it. A classroom duel is one thing, but battling dark wizards, or as ever more likely, goblins, is a different kettle of Grindelows entirely. Understood, Professor. So. I'd advise you to keep practicing whenever you can. Perhaps Mr. Sallow will have some ideas for you. Again, well done today. I shall reach out soon with additional assignments. Gotcha. All right. That's enough spectacle for one day. Class is dismissed. As I talk to homeboy right here. If you know the right spells, it's dark wizards that'll fear you, not the other way around. Oh. Get off me, what? Huh. Always thought Levioso was for first years. Not anymore. Oh, what? what what's up with y'all? What y'all trying to do? Well, all right. All right. That's my guy, Arthur, right here. What's up, Arthur? That's my boy. Oh, I'm not much for dueling. I prefer to keep things friendly. 
All right, my guy. And I'm going to let you just. I ain't even going to do you like that. I'm going to just leave you alone, let you talk to Shorty, and I'm going to go my, my other way. Nice work. I enjoyed that. Well, that duel was quite something. Everyone will be talking about it. It was certainly good practice. Yeah, it easy to beat a Slytherin. It felt more like I was dueling an expert. Sebastian Sallow, by the way. Didn't expect a new student to be so deft with a wand. Then again, perhaps this wasn't your first duel. In fact, it was. Perhaps I have a knack for it. Be coy if you like, but I know better. Magic requires intention and talent. You know, you might be a perfect fit for a certain exclusive, unsanctioned dueling organization. I had to lie. Uh, sound exclusive and unsanctioned. Sounds Count intriguing. Excellent. Knew I was right about you. If you want to get the most out of your time at Hogwarts, you're going to need to break the rules now and then. Whether it's joining a secret dueling club or sneaking into the restricted section of the library, you just have to be clever enough not to get caught. Thank you, Sebastian. I'll keep that in mind. Good. Pleasure chatting with you. I'm sure I'll see you soon. Perhaps somewhere unsanctioned? Chase their money. See if your performance today was sheer luck or actual skill. Look for Luke and Brattleby near the clock tower entrance. If you're interested. Okay. Till next time. Nobody talks about what happens in Fight Club. Mazzy, who does that? You drooled Sebastian. He's strong competition. Well done. That's all you gotta say to me? Alright. Don't be coming, don't be coming in my room talking about some, oh yeah, this and that. I'm, I'm, I'm leaving. Nah. Um, let's check the map. What we got, what we got, what we got. What's this? Weasley after class. Uh, I don't know if I want to go do that for yet. How, how do I see the smaller quest? There it is. Cross wands. Let's go. Let's go do right quick. Wait. Oh, it's tracked. Locate on the map. All right, gotcha. Is there anything over here? Oh, I can't set no waypoint. All right, we're gonna have to run. I'm gonna go see what they're talking about. See if I can get some of this action in. I think, like, I, I used to talk to my, uh, I'm not saying used to, but I talked to my friends and I was talking about, like, how we're in a golden age of video games and, we, and there's going to be, like, a shift, right? Like, five years ago, so to say, it was all battle, battle royals, battle royals, battle royals. I think now we're in an age where everything is about to be open world. Like, you go from 2K open world, this open world, GTA. You know, Red Dead, all these open world games, and I think uh, I'm excited for what that could turn out to be. Oh, level one lock. Um. So. Get him out of. He come. You know what? I'm gonna. I'm gonna leave him alone. But if he come mess with me, I'm popping him. And I'm talking about a Varkadabra, however you say it. Let me see what's this. Lumos. Have you thought of playing P P I Z Z? It's cut off uh, on the chat, so uh. Lumos. Could you uh let me know what it what you said? Can I help you? By retyping it for me. This dude like the guy off of uh, Jesse that passed away, rest in peace. Sebastian told me to see you about a club. If Sebastian vouches for you, that's all I need to know. Pizza Tower. No, I have not played that. I've never heard of that, actually. I'm about to look it up. It's invitation only, so you must have really impressed Sebastian. I'm flattered to hear that. Sebastian's not a bad duelist either. 
imagine it's quite something to see the two of you duel. How does cross wands work exactly? You show up, I match you with other duelists, and whoever is still standing in the end wins. <laughs> it looks like a warrior. So way of determining the school's greatest duelist once and for all. And to liven things up, the winner is awarded a prize. Interested? So what is it like an old like arcade game type game? Of course, dueling's an entertaining pastime. I agree. Besides, in cross ones, you could duel with a partner if you like. Your first time, I'll pair you with Sebastian. Next time, you'll need to bring a partner along or duel alone. So, care to step into the ring? Come on. Get me in the ring. I had to think about it. Spectacular. Let the fireworks begin. We'll make you regret signing up. Damn. Why are they talking that crazy? An indie title. Okay. Break through yellow shields. Cast level. Oh, nice. Okay. Oh, they can't rock with me. Oh, come on. Oh, I pressed Lumos. I didn't want to do that. Okay, there we go. What has he got that he's... Oh, she's done. That's dubs. That's dubs. Quick work. Easy work. I'm about to check that out, man. Um, nice work. Let's see what it's Let's about. Watch some YouTube about on that. There's strong competition ahead, but keep this up, and you could be the next school champion. Brilliant. Count me in. I shall. Now it takes time to organize these duels, but check with me later. I may have something lined up for you. Again, congratulations on your first crossed ones victory. Well fought. Thank you, Mr. Lucan Brato Bay. Here again. Oh, that was fire. So, if I'm not mistaken, right? I think I accidentally saw this. You hit right trick right on D-pad, and these are all the spells you can learn. So, yellow breaks the yellow. I don't know. Yellow breaks the yellow blocking. What's this? Yeah, everybody on TikTok and stuff was like, Slytherin is the best, Slytherin is the best. But I did the Harry Potter quiz on Wizarding World, and based on my personality, they said I was Hufflepuff. And I was like, you know what, I'm going to go all in with it, you know? So, uh, I saw him using fire, so these are damage spells. These are force spells, and these are control spells, and then utility, so like light, okay apparel but my thing is this do i have to switch to each of these like or will they pop up when i need them you see what i mean so we'll just have to oh crucia unforgivable uh and imperial okay we're not gonna talk about these three at the bottom you know i haven't i haven't ventured to the dog side hufflepuff gang let's go Said that travel broadens the mind. <laughs> he said he aiming for the top. Man, this dude is on some real sinister shit. Uh, I'm just gonna go right here though. Go to the top. Oops. I'm gonna go to this tower. Don't you love playing on a PS5 with the games? Uh, have minimal loading time screens. Loading screen times. Sorry. Uh, that only took me like five seconds to get over here. Alright, let's go see what Professor Weasley is talking about. Wait, 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 wait. So, when you upgrade, like they just said I was a different level. Is there something I can upgrade? Because it got me as level three. No, ain't nothing. 
Oh, my health went up. It was 200 before. Uh, that's fine. Where's it going? Let me unlock this. Crummy little faces. I'll just die. There we go. What are you up to now? Everybody that's tuned in, man, if you like this, man, and you want to see more, make sure you drop a f subscribe, you know, like, like the video, share the video, notification gang, man, I'm going to be on streaming this every day until we beat it, and then, you know, 100% it, I'm looking to go after this to that new Jedi Fallen Order after that, and I'll be excited to play that with you guys, and also, if you check the channel, you can go see God of War uh, Ragnarok gameplay. What about the room, Professor? I was thinking the same thing, Deke. Perhaps you could help. Oh, What's good, Mark? Excuse, Deke. Ah, there you are. I trust your first classes went well? They did, Professor. I heard as much from Professors Hecate and Ronan. Seems <laughs> Professor Fig taught you quite a bit. Ruin Leon is a great YouTuber, man. He's been doing this shit for years, man. There's a deal more to your travels here than what you've told me, isn't there? He the one who got me started in this. Wait, I'd wager there's a good deal more to your travels here than what you've told me, isn't there? Nothing more, Professor. I see. Like trying to get a sonnet from a streeler. Regardless, you must continue to build upon what you've learned. In that regard, I've asked your professors to help hasten your progress with some extra assignments. Professor Ronan did mention something about that. In fact, Professor Ronan will meet you outside momentarily to assign your first one. Now, regarding the trip to Hogsmeade I mentioned earlier, We've arranged to replace the supplies lost on your way here, including seeds, potion recipes, and spell crafts. Thank you, Professor. And Mr. Ollivander will connect you with the perfect wand. You've managed your <coughs> classes well with a borrowed wand, but you'll find the magic you cast with your own wand to be far superior. Okay, uh... There's an Ollivander's in Hogsmeade. There is. Most people are familiar with the shop in Diagon Alley. Right, that's what We're I thought. We're fortunate to have someone like him nearby. Mr. Ollivander is a genuine craftsman and highly skilled wand maker. I would trust no one else to pair me with a wand. Okay, and then what's a spellcraft? I've never heard of a spellcraft before, Professor. What is it? A spellcraft is a recipe of sorts used when conjuring objects. I shall explain more about them when you begin working with transfiguration magic. Gotcha. I'm eager to get to Hogsmeade. Very well. I'm I eager to get to, to Hogsmeade. I'll visit to the village with a classmate. Help you get your bearings. Perhaps Sebastian Sallo or Natsai Onai. I've noticed you spending time with them. I'm going to go with Natty. Sebastian kind of. Ah, chat, what y'all think, man? Either or. Natty, yeah, obviously, is a female, but she probably got, like, vibranium or something hidden. And Sebastian, I just went to war with Sebastian. We just went fighting. I kinda, I'm kind of cool with both of them. Sebastian seemed like... Mm, he hard to trust, man. It's hard to trust them Slytherin guys. For sure, bro. We got to stream together, man. Whether, whatever it is, you know. Just let me know. 2K Call of Duty. I ain't really. That, I'm mad at Call of Duty, but I still, you know, I'm better than at least the trash nigga. I think I'm gonna go with Natty, fellas. I'd like to go with Natty. Excellent choice. Miss Onai is one of our most talented students, and she knows the area. She'll keep you well clear of any of Victor Rookwood's undesirables. On the I retired from Madden, Lou. Like, I swear to God, I went and bought an Xbox 360 so I could play that NCAA 14. That fucking Madden pisses me off, bro. I'm done with that shit. I, I see you haven't seen it on my channel no more. That shit is trash. 
No time to waste. The sooner you complete your work, the sooner you can enjoy a butterbeer at the Three Broomsticks. Okay, nice. Yeah, Lou, I had to retire from that man. Man, I threw a fucking pass that was like three yards. It was a league game. I threw a pass that was like three yards and uh, they had like 22 seconds on the clock. And the rundown, the clock rundown when I did the hurry up ran to zero. I'm like, bro, what? Like, why the hell would a three yard play and getting back the line took 20 seconds? That's crazy. Anyway, so I was like, man, fuck this game. It's too random. They don't care about franchise anyway. So I just was like, man, I'm not rocking with it no more. Let's go see what Professor Ronan wants. Ah, there you are. You have a new spell to teach me, Professor. Indeed I do. And an exceedingly useful one at that. The mending charm, Repero. Fixes Repero. things right up. Makes a broken object good as new in the blink of an eye. Hmm. It seems as if that might come in handy. More frequently than one would imagine. As Professor Weasley mentioned, I am not the <laughs> only one who will you be see what I'm saying, bro? outside of class Three franchises, in an man? to catch you up with your peers. A number of your professors have agreed to do so as well. But first, each shall ask that you complete a few preliminary tasks to hone your magic. I have arranged some for today. He abandoned, yeah, he See had to. And then if you're talking about Madden, me. I know for sure. We will have you casting Ropero in no time. I'll start on the task right away, Professor. Okay. <laughs> Ropero. Collect the flying page near the broken statue. Collect the flying page in the dark arts uh, area. Okay, so how am I going to collect this? This is the right area. Oh, I'm tripping. Pages. I know how to do it. Got him. How you doing, Kareeb247? What's going on, man? Thanks for tuning in, bro. A flying page must be around here somewhere. Got it. Come on. Shout out to everybody in here, man. Um, I like to make a positive community and a positive, you know, streaming little network. Everybody drop y'all, you know, you can drop your YouTube, drop your Twitch or whatever in the chat. Everybody go follow everybody, man. And I'm going to shout you out once I read it. Tasks weren't too much. I completed the assignments, Professor. Marvelous. You clearly know your way around basic charms. Let us give the old mending charm a try then, shall we? Remember to be deliberate in your enunciation and movements. I want to see some vigor. Now, wand at the ready. Yes, sir. Remember. <coughs> oh, this one's crazy. Of your magic. Whoa, what's up, A Man Dre Man? What's up, man? All right, y'all ready? Reparo. Got it. But how would I know that's broken? Oh, obviously. That's it. Very good. If you would like to practice mending something, have a go with that broken statue in the alcove by the water. <laughs> it originally symbolized heartbreak. Perhaps a jilted lover thought it too accurate and lashed out. Repair. Nicely done. Works like a charm, doesn't it? <laughs> Repair. Whoever broke this, they heart was broke. Cause they ain't gonna make no sense to break this. It don't make no sense. Alright, where we headed at, fellas? Alright, we look looks like we're gonna go. Welcome to Hogsmeade, Ancient Magic Throw, Ancient Magic, alright, um, we ain't been to two places, and that's the Library Annex, and that is the Astronomy Wing, but it's fine, we don't have to go there now, oh, you know, it don't make sense to get everything out in the first, oh, they see it, this seems like there's a chest over here, oh, am I tripping, am I tweaking?
<laughs> when I first uh heard about this, what the hell? Oh, open this. Okay, I guess I can't. When I first heard about this game, though, I thought it was gonna be like multiplayer, which would have been insane. Everybody thought you was gonna be able to play uh, uh, Quidditch with everyone. There's something in there. I just know it. What do you want? Hello, Lenora. What are you looking at? Everyone thinks I'm utterly balmy. Samantha thinks I'm potty. Oh, it's a puzzle lot. Like, okay. Painting. I never noticed it before. If I know Hogwarts, and I do, an empty frame doesn't appear for no reason. There's something more to this. Have you gained any insights about the painting since you've been studying it? I did discover that casting Lumos has an effect. Yeah, it would be nice if that's like DLC. But like, I'm not sure what to do next. Are there any other empty paintings like this in school? Yes, a few. This entire place is somewhat of a riddle, to be honest. If I can work out the riddle of this one, I'll know what to do with all of them. As good a place as any to begin. If I have the time, I may look. Could be intriguing. <sighs> I've been racking my brains long enough. I hope you'll a multiplayer quitter game, quitters game, make it VR. Well, that's crazy. Come and find me if you stumble on that's the that's actually insane. The um, what I want to say about that last comment, uh, like, what if they do it? Like, remember when GTA came out in 2013, and like online wasn't really popping like that. So, ooh, Spider Man does come out this year. I'm gonna be doing that too. That's crazy. I did Miles Morales and the other Spider-Man. I didn't post the other one, but um, yeah, I can't wait for that also. But what was I saying was, if they do it like that, where they introduce online to GTA and they introduce online to this, this that would be fire too. I'm thinking about copping that VR. I gotta see what it's about, man. I went to Universal Studios. Oh, what the hell? That spot must be a clue. I should look okay. around in case it's nearby. Okay. I'm gonna just do a quick look. If it ain't like somewhere real close, and I ain't fucking with it. Oh, it's over here. Okay, nice. This looks like the location from the painting. What could be so special about it? Let's get you back to your frame, little moth. Yeah, I went to Universal Studios, and a lot of their games was like VR type stuff. <laughs> I knew there was a connection. I should tell the Nora that I solved the puzzle <laughs> of that empty frame. Oh, it's great. I know damn well I'd be running into shit and breaking my TV and stuff with a VR. I already know. The Nora, I solved the mystery of that painting. You did? How? Why would he not tell? That's gatekeeping, bro. Why would you do that? Just tell her. I found the location depicted in the painting, and then I cast Lumos to guide a moth back to the frame. All very logical, I suppose. Pity I was so close to. How you it. doing, Sammy, mom? Um. Natty's good at that too. So is. I don't understand that question. Just tend to over -explain. Like why? I'm why? Why, why I'm not transferring my character? I I loaded it up, and I. I from the uh, Wizarding World website. So I just transferred everything in like that and I was able to uh, be Hufflepuff and they like loaded my wand in here whenever we go. That's not what he meant. What he meant? That's so crazy that all the like the knights and stuff are alive. That's I just it's so interactive. Hello. Oh, so she gonna go with me? Yeah, I'm looking for you. Natty, I hope I haven't kept Oh, you <laughs> Not at all. 
Well, to answer your question, my character is not transgender because I am not transgender. Things again, and to see the village. I've been looking forward to it. Good. Shall we set off? I intend to give you a first-rate Hogsmeade experience. Come on, Natty. I was glad Professor Weasley asked me to accompany you. Mm. Really? Yes. I had planned to extend an invitation to you myself. I thought you might enjoy a better be in the village. <laughs> the timing of Professor Weasley's owl was perfect. I guess we could be we could be cool. Oh, I cannot tell you how nice it is to breathe fresh air after being cooped up in ancient rooms. Grave Man, look at this. Oh, I thought I fell off the map. When your mother was the one who elected that you take it. Okay. Imagine you got a pot that go around your garden in real life, just water and stuff. This time of year, everyone will tell you to visit at Christmas. But that's one of the few times of year I would rather be indoors. <laughs> not much for the cold, are you? Oh, I do not mind the cold. I can't so wait much. to get my swag up too. What are you doing? To to. I did not grow up around snow. I feel it. Me either. I grew up in New Orleans, Louisiana, and you know they ain't got oh, no snow wait, down there. Over here. I often spot lace wing flies in this area. <laughs> oh, this What's isn't so Pokemon. They are interesting to look at, but if you stew them, you can also use them in potion making. Mm, potion. Okay, you don't fall off the map like that? Alright, fine. This dude trolling, man. Look, what was that? From the Forbidden Forest. Hippogriffs. I wonder Where do you see that at? Oh. Uh, why I got scared? That hippogriffs had been spotted nearby. You think Poppy's already seen the hippogriffs? Absolutely. Arthur, you might not. You must not mess with me no more. It's fine. We don't need you. I'm gonna stick with my new friend. That's the forbidden forest on the left. It's off limits to students, as the name implies. Why is it off limits? The professors claim it is too dangerous. I think that calling it forbidden only makes it more alluring. Exactly. Ah, there's Hogsmeade over the crest. Past that ruin. Bro, this is amazing. I'm about to rewatch all of the movies. All of them. I would spend all of my time exploring if I could. I confess, I was surprised when Professor Weasley mentioned that you knew the area, caps. since you're relatively new here. She said that? Ooh. She knows more about me than I had thought. I will say, while I certainly learn a great deal... Why would you class, only watch the last two? Man, if you don't go watch all... You have to watch all of them to get the story and understand what you need to understand and get, get, get in depth and, and integrate it into the universe. How are you settling in? Prison of Azkaban, the best one, though. I don't care what nobody said. Everything was so new and unfamiliar. The lake to the right. I'm getting used to things. What about you? Do you find me? I still miss my homeland. Beautiful here too. And getting out of the castle and exploring helped me to adjust quite a bit. Hogwarts has Cap. become something of a home. boy. You capping like a That's a line. Mr. Moon! He is the Hogwarts caretaker. Looks a bit worse for wear. Hello, Mr. Moon. Have you met our new fifth year? Pleasure. Um, you might want to turn back, Miss on I. Uh, turn and run. Is everything all right, sir? 
Oh, it looked right at me. Eyes big as saucers. What did Mr. Moon? He's so, drunk. Guys, Dougly and Arian. Mm, terrifying. I shall be at the castle where it's safe. Good luck to both of you. Poor yeah, he's definitely. A demigod. I think he had too much fun in the village. I will say she had never seen him in such a place. Nearly there. There is much to see outside of the castle walls, not just Hogsmeade. Yeah. I am happy to explore whenever you'd like. Rumors being what they are about goblins and such, it might be nice to have a friend with you. I'll keep that in mind, Natty. Thank you. Yo, new here. Hope you have fun playing this game. Shall it cut off for me in the bottom right? But how you doing, Soul Seven Ten? And here we are. Thanks for tuning in. It is hot to Glad to have to you start. here. The Three Broomsticks is the place for butter beer, and you can get any sweet you can imagine at Honey Dukes. I could not choose a favorite shop here. It changes with every visit. I can tell you that you are certain to find everything you need in Hogsmeade. Professor Weasley said that you need to get potion recipes, spellcrafts, some seeds, and... A new wand. Of course. You will enjoy Mr. Ollivander, and I am keen to see what you will do with a wand of your own. You should be able to collect everything you need and still have time to explore a little as well. Experience Hogsmeade at your own pace. We can meet up in the town circle when you are finished. Enjoy yourself. I will see you soon. Hogsmeade is brimming with different sites, shops, and other points of interest you can navigate using the field guide. I got you. Nice. Damn, this map huge. Look at that. Okay, there's a lot of stuff we could do. Sporting good for brooms and stuff. Okay. Can we go buy a broom? What this is this? Level 2 lock. Oh, damn. Let's see if we go. Visit. Hold up. This shit got me confused as hell. Alright. Oh, the barber. Broom and pack. Okay. Let's go to Ollivander's first. Oh, it's right here. You gonna rock with me or? Oh no, she gone. Oh. Ring, ring, ring. I'll be right with. Ah, it's you. Um, just a moment, please. Ah, hello, sir. I'm looking for for a new wand. Yes, it's about time. Yes, I. About time? Well, you're our new fifth year student, are you not? Oh, what am I saying? Of course you are. Gerbold Ollivander's the name. But of course, you'll have heard of the Ollivanders, I'm sure. Finest one makers in the world. It's a pleasure to meet you. Truly. Now, come with me. Let's find you the perfect one, shall we? Mm, uh, no, 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 not you. Um, ah, yes. Yes. Hmm. Powerful core. Ten and a half inches. Hmm. You might do. Mm hmm Here. Give this one a try. Well, go ahead. Swish. Hmm. How odd. Uh, once more. Come on. Really swish it. Oh! oh That ain't the one. Well, this isn't a good match at all, is it? I don't know. I had them gloves already in my inventory for some reason we when I went to look. Not to worry. Mm. No, not you. Uh, uh, hmm. Perhaps. Yes. A rare wood, thirteen and three quarter inches, dragon heart string. Let's give this one a try. This don't look right. Yeah, it didn't look right. Looks like it's back to the shelf for you. 
<sighs> I need my black this walnut, is man. Be trickier than I had anticipated. How perplexing. Um, where are you? Perhaps you? Uh, ah, there you are. Should be fourteen. I think you might be the one. Here, take it. Ah, black water unicorn hair, man. Come on, bro. Yes, indeed. So when I did my um my test, oh, uh, we could change the color. How intriguing. When I did my uh my test on the Wizarding World uh website, this how it looked. Curious indeed. This one's cool, but this how it looked right here. Unyielding flexibility, yep. It was unicorn hair, yep. Hmm. A unicorn hair wand is most reliable. And faithful to its owner. What do you think? Man, I'm finna go order my shit right now. Boy, your wine trash, boy. Extraordinary. <laughs> another wand, another beginning of a bright and magical future. <laughs> There's a dragon heart string. Now, how did that feel? Good. Different. I sense the sort of surge of some kind. A match. Your connection seemed particularly powerful. The right wand will learn from you, just as you learn from it. I'm mm. eager to try it out. Indeed. Treat it well, and you shall find no more dependable a wand than one with a unicorn hair core. And the bond between you and your wand should only grow stronger. <laughs> like Don't be but a vodka at your new wand's ability to perceive your intentions, particularly in a moment of need. That sounds wonderful, I'm dodging that. I'll let you get to it. Do come and see me again, if ever I can be of further assistance. All right, Olivanda. I appreciate that. I picked up something out that chest too, y'all. I'm about to put it on right now. I picked up some different gloves. Purple gloves. Oh, look at this. Oh, look at these. Talk to me. It's finna get wicked. Okay, I'm gonna wind handles. I don't know what that means, but... All right. See you later. It's a good thing we have auras. Is all I'm saying. All right. What's next? There was some other shit we had to go to. Wait. Let me look at the map. Okay. We need to visit the magic neat Pippin's potions and tomes and scrolls. Oh, I passed up tomes and scrolls. Let me run back down there to that. Damn, why he run like you right? Why do he run like that? That boy's sprinting hard. But he ain't going nowhere. Get in there. Get inside. An inquiring mind. Let me see what you got in here, brother. Come on, man. Why he gotta run like that? I knew there was a chest up here. Great Saul of us tailor hat. See, I don't want that though. I want some. I want some like Assassin Creed looking shit. Pardon me, sir. I'm here for the spellcrafts. Professor Weasley ordered. Matilda, student. I thought I might be seeing you soon. I am the proprietor here, mm -hmm. Thomas Brown. I take it you've had a conjuring lesson then. I'm afraid I haven't yet, sir. Ah, but you will soon enough. It is magic at its purest, creating something out of nothing. Of course, it is not without complexity, but that is where my spellcrafts come in. Stay the course, and you could soon impress even yeah. Professor Weasley. 
See, I so what I've learned in like all these like open world games, you have to go the opposite way of where they want you to go before you go where they want you to go. Just in case. I mean, it don't hurt him nothing there. Or decoration. But I shall let Professor Weasley do the teaching. For now, let's get the spell crafts you need. A potting table and a potion station. Yes? I believe so, sir. Good. Nothing like being able to grow your own ingredients and brew what you want, when you want. Let's have a look. Let's look at what we have, shall we? Okay, what are we looking for? Are we... I'm definitely getting whatever for free right if now. If you're interested, feel free to take a look around at the rest of my inventory. Okay. Can I sell some shit? I'm finna sell this. I know... They want me to keep this hat, but I don't want to wear this stupid ass shit. So I'm going to sell that. I'm going to sell this. Give me some bread. I'm not wearing this scarf. I'm selling that. And I'm never wearing this hat. I'm selling that. And I'm probably not wearing these glasses. All right. There we go. So I sold everything I don't need. But I got me a, a little potting table. Now we need to go to Pippin's Potions. Man, in Universal Studios, this place is amazing. Like, they got all this stuff. And you go get all type of souvenirs. You go make a uh, wand, your own wand at Ollivander's. You can go, you know, uh, drink the butter beer. You go do all this type of stuff. Um, Yeah, I, could, I can change it, but just not yet. I haven't found an area yet to, like, go customize my uh, character. And I haven't bought... The, I didn't buy the deluxe of uh, like the version. Up oh, there we go. See, you see, I just found that scarf just now, so I'm gonna see what it does to my character. Let's see, it's a blue scarf. It adds some more offense. Okay, that's fine. I'm chill with this right now. Before. But y'all gotta always check these chests, man. Always, always. Look around, make sure nothing else in here. All right. Pardon me, sir. Oh, thank goodness. When I heard the bell, I thought you were Miss Lawang. Not that she deigns to come here. Though, I don't believe I've seen your face here before, either. It's my first time in Hogsmeade, actually. Is it really? Well, Parry Pippin at your service. And this is J. Pippin's Potions. Potions for all ailments. <laughs> You'll have read it on the sign, of course, but Grandfather always made me say it in full. <laughs> How may I help you today? Professor Weasley sent me to collect some recipes. I'm new at Hogwarts. You're the student she sent the owl about. I set your things aside immediately. I suspected if you're anything like I was at your age, you'd want your potion supplies. Is it not the most fascinating art potion making? Rivals anything you can do with a wand, I've always said. A potion's really that versatile. They may not be as showy as spell work, but make no mistake, they are just as powerful. They all can right. heal, destroy, protect. You'll discover all of this soon enough. As it's your first time in, I should mention that it's not just potion recipes I sell. I also offer ready-made drafts for all manner of uses, and I unveil new ones from time to time. Pop in when you can so you don't... Uh, miss out on anything hmm? but for now let's get you those recipes shall we what can i do for you today okay supplies let's just take what's free again we don't need too much wigan weld feel free to take a look at the rest of my inventory what's or going on mr gamer time, if you're in a rush today oh um. I just like to shout out everybody who, you know, hops in. So we can weld is the health, maximize the spell damage. Okay, invisibility, that's nice. And, okay. Okay. Alright, so we're gonna get this money up. We're gonna get this money up. Magic Neep is the last thing we need to go to. Which is all the way in the back right here. But I might go to the barber, man. Since Niggas got shit to say about my appearance. I might go to the barber. Well, hello there. 
how's it going? But before we talk, I know you got a chest over here. Six coins. Look at all these tickets. Is it? It was just that bag of coins, man. That's all we got. All right. Pardon me, sir. I'm here for the seeds Professor Weasley arranged for me to collect. Oh, the Dittany for the new fifth year. <laughs> I take it that's you then. Merlin's beard. Starting Hogwarts is a fifth year. You must be positively reeling from it all. Not at all. I'm choosing to see it all as one big adventure. Well, bravo. <laughs> Not everyone has the temperament to take things as they come. Name's Timothy Teasdale, by the way, and this is my shop, the Magic Neep. I keep the cart out here because I like a good chat. Can't be All right, Mr. Teasdale. Of things if I'm away inside now, can I? I suppose not. In addition to seeds, I have plenty of plants. Grow everything myself. My speciality is potion ingredients. Even Pippin purchases from me. But what say we get you a package of Dittany seeds? Let me guess. You're after something fresh. Yeah, we're just gonna take whatever this is. Didn't he say it? That's all I want. I ain't spending no money on this. I'm spending money on myself. Alright, well, Mr. Tisdale. You thought I wasn't gonna catch you? Okay, they saying meet Natty in a town circle, but I ain't ready. I got a couple more things I gotta do. I'm gonna hit this barber. And then. I ain't gonna get no broom yet. I'm gonna just go with the. I ain't crazy. I'm gonna get the free broom that they're gonna give me. Because I know they're gonna give me one. Like I said, a swaggy Steve Urkel. <laughs> what is this? Oh. Right, let's go up here. You gotta have a chest in here too, huh? Yep. A patchwork sorcerer's hat. That big gold. I don't wanna wear it though. I might sell it later, but we, you know, I'm glad we got it. Hello. That. Oh, come in. Come in. Welcome to Madame Snelling's Tress Emporium. <laughs> I'm sure I've no need to introduce myself. They used to call me Snelly. Oh, Snelly, why aren't you studying to be an aura? But I showed them. They're stuck in the dust at the ministry, and I'm here thriving. Absolutely thriving. But look at you. Look at you. I can certainly see why you paid me a visit. Looking for a change, are we? Uh, why not, I say? What sort of change? Some are going for that. Muggle with consumption, sort of death becomes me allure. Okay. You won't find poisons here. No need for chloride of lime or ammonia when you have magic. Why don't you spend a moment choosing how you'd like to look? You can change your hair too if you'd like. All uh, right, for sure. Let me what see services how much... do you offer? Let me see how much she charging. What is it you she... might be interested in? Is she charging an arm and a leg? I know, man. I know, bro. I probably go with my OG Cookie Bush. I don't like the fade on here, man. I look, I look like Jada Pinkett. <laughs> Keep my na my wife name out your fucking mouth. It's uh, only twenty though, so that ain't nothing bad. See, that's too much. I'm gonna just go with the Bush, bro. Oh, they had corn rolls too. The corn rolls crazy. I ain't go. Oh, the corn rolls crazy, bro. Ah. <laughs> now this is the story all about. <laughs> corn rolls a bush, y'all. What we doing? What we doing? Corn rolls a bush. 
That's the only two I really like. Somebody first vote. That Riley Freeman. Oh, that be fire. I ain't gonna start that shit fire. <laughs> like a nigga from downtown. <laughs> okay, we gonna go cornrows. Talk to me. Hey. Hey. All right, Snelly Snell. We out this thing. You hear me? Let's go. All right, Natty. Natty gonna be like, ooh. Let's see what she said. Let's see what she said. We out this thing. I'm gonna hurt of you. Ah. Talk to me. Ah, I have everything. I see what you meant about not being able to pick a favorite shop. <laughs> we should walk around a bit more. Perhaps today is the day I finally pick one. Okay. What is that? Boy, what? <laughs> what the fuck? Get his ass. Talk to me. Come on, boy. What you need? Pap, 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 pap. Gotcha. Why not press Lumos? Oh, I can't lift him up. Come on. My pot. I didn't watch my. Wait, what's the other one? Oh, good, good move, boy. Was trying to beat him his own head. I like it too much. Oh. Spamming him, spamming him, spamming him. Come on, come on. Good move. We need to make sure he stays that way. Oh, he smacked her. Oh, she done. Oh, gotcha again. I'm sorry. Invoke ancient magic. What is this? Listen <laughs> up! <laughs> Bruh. <laughs> Goodness, a second troll. Did Come you on, man. A fully grown troll by yourselves. I suppose so. It's all a bit of a blur, to be honest. Merlin's beard. Are you all right? We are, and we were glad to help. I'd say help is a bit of an understatement. Nerve like that. The makings of an aura, if you ask me. Appreciate it, appreciate it, so. Perhaps the two of you wouldn't mind helping me put a few things back to where they were. Of course, officer. Singer. Officer Singer. And thank you, again. Oh, that's the police? Oh! That's a lot of repair we gotta do. Repair. Oh, uh, no, no. thing for Officer Singer to worry about. I thought she was done when she got smacked. I ain't gonna lie. And you know what's crazy? Like, nothing could never be damaged. Imagine if this was real. All the damage people had, like, from, like, natural disasters and stuff. You literally just put that shit right back together. Supposedly, there's one more thing. I'm gonna just hold X and see what it does. All right. 
That was actually fun, man. <laughs> the Black Mary Poppins. Fuck is you talking about? Look at him. Ah, uh, ah, uh, ah. Uh. I need new drip, though. I definitely need a new drip. We were just talking about you. I'm drinking. Oh, they got a chest over here. Repair. Wait, why I did repair? I didn't mean to do that. Wait, this chest ain't. Go to sleep. Lumos. Protego. Lumos. Damn, the chest ain't doing nothing with me right now. Let's see if we can get something else. Find something. Dang, I can't do nothing to that boy. All right, let's see. What else we got? I know I probably shouldn't be back here, but search the bag. 31. There we go. There we go. I knew I had to get something out of here. Bippity bobbity boo. Come on, man. Talk to me. Let's go. Hello, sir. That was I fun. We've met. Allow me to introduce myself. Augustus Hill. Clothier extraordinaire. I should like to thank you for your remarkable bravery in fighting those trolls, and not to mention your help restoring Hogsmeade to its rightful state. Okay. I was happy to help. Frankly, you deserve an Order of Merlin. But I can offer you something much more useful. I own Gladrag's wizard wear, and among my inventory are some unique items that afford certain protections, as it were. Life-saving protections. And as I suspect this won't be. Yeah, it's cold long, outside. So of course, my man's got I'd like to give you one such set of robes. In thanks for what you did today. Thank you, Mr. Hill. That's very generous of you. It's the least I can do. Uh, now, uh, let's try this on for size, shall we? Plenty for your perusal today. Take your time. Oh, dog. What does he about to give me? Preview. Let's preview it. Compare. Okay, so let's get it. All right, let's check some of this shit out. All a part of the wizard drip. Okay. All right. Oh, gear screen. I'm sorry. All right. All right. All right. All right. Let me see. Oh, so there's no physical difference. Let's check this out. Preview this gear. Got the gear. Nah, I'm gonna sell this though. Well, let me see. That's no value. Damn. This bitch is kind of. Let's see how I look. What's for an it. extraordinary introduction to Hogsmeade. I would say that we, and you in particular, have earned at least one butter beer. Shall we head to the Three Broomsticks? Sounds like a good idea. Wonderful. Just down this way then. All right, before we go to our... Oh, I sell even more battle-worthy items. Oh, I... No, not this one. Rebellion, let's welcome to peruse my shop at your... That chest was not right there all the time. Okay, so I want to see something before we leave, because it's all about what Deion Sanders said. You look good, you play good. Let me see how I look with this hat on. If I look stupid, I'm selling it. I gotta look stupid. Okay. But it gives me six defense. But I still look stupid. That's fine. We're going to sell it to get this money up. Plenty for your perusal today. Take your time. See, that's the slithering shit. I don't want no slithering shit. Flamboyant cloak. Uh -huh. Dragon long coat. Or there's two dragon long coat. Mm. So all these clothes go under. I guess we'll just wait until they got more stuff because I don't want neither none of this and I I guess I'll just stay in my Hogsworth stuff. Let me make sure that's everything in here. 
Do, 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 do. We go. Alright. Look up. Oh, I can't. I can't run. Assuming it is not too busy, you might even meet Serona, the owner. She is a charming hostess and a powerful witch. Good one to know. I need to start using Revelio more so I could not miss anything. Who is that? <gasps> That's your she boy. Said you could get to the child when they came to Hogsmeade. That all you needed was a distraction. I gave you a distraction. I just watched a student take down your distraction. Who is this child? What are you not telling me? All you need to know is that if you cannot get to the child, then you have no value to me. <laughs> Let's go. Let's go. Serious bug. Serious bug. We out of here. Did they see us? I don't think so. What was that goblin doing with Victor Rookwood? Vanrock is working with Rookwood. The goblin from the Daily Prophet. I knew I'd seen him somewhere. Oh. That's okay. nice. Okay, Let's I would love to do that. Broomsticks. Make make it invisible so I can see that just like cosmetic. And then the stats would be different. It's yeah, I like that. to see you, Lord Gok. I shall let you know if I hear anything. Thank you, Serona. You be well. Yeah, they had to see me. Now, what can I... Oh, there's a face I haven't seen before. <laughs> it's my first time here. Welcome. Butterbeer's on me. Appreciate it. Heard about the attack. I shall be looking in on the other shopkeepers and residents shortly. Glad to see you two escaped injury. Thanks to this one, single-handedly took down a troll. Is that right? Well done. Thanks for this. My pleasure. I will say. I think my stupid trolls, ass when I was in, in Orlando. Uh, that's never happened. I ain't before. get a chance to try it. I I don't know why I didn't buy it. That's not right. To see what it tastes like. The only brutes we usually have to deal with. Are, uh, <gasps> Oh, this thing's right here. Was that Lodgok I saw leaving just now? <laughs> Your clientele's not what it used to be, Serona. Not to worry, Victor. Once the two of you leave, the caliber of my clientele will greatly improve. I wouldn't do that if I were you, Theophilus. Come now. No need for theatrics. I'm only here for this one anyway. What you want with me, boy? I'm enjoying a well-earned butterbeer. Only want a quick word. Perhaps you didn't hear me. Yeah. I said, Come on. My friend is busy. One would think you all had enough bloodshed for one day. Come, the ovens. The three broomsticks isn't what it used to be. Let's take our galleons elsewhere. Yeah, yeah, go ahead. You can't drink butterbeer forever. Get to stepping. Because you don't want these problems, player. You don't want these problems. Just wait till I learn them. I'm not even going to say it. We're Hufflepuff. We don't have to go down that road. Rookwood and Harlow are worse than any troll you might encounter. Trolls, Ranrock, and Rookwood. What are you not telling me? I Theopolis. I but it's perhaps best I do that later. See, I think that now might be a good time to head back to the castle. Yeah, we can head back. Revelio. Something up there. Something up there. There ain't nothing in here I could take. I guess we leave. Hey, everybody in here. Oh, I'm going upstairs. Yep. 50. Chest. Some more gloves. That's why you loot. 
And it's a big ass building. When I figure out how to open them locks, I'm going into every building on the game. No, I ain't done. I'm gonna go back downstairs. And We're ready. Okay, nothing is in here. There we go. Hey, everybody. Thank you and appreciate y'all for having my back in the three broomsticks. Because when it come down to the come down, we're going to see who really about what they're talking about. All right? Serious out. Yeah, we need to get back. It's kind of getting dark, huh? I'm certainly glad Serona was there. And that she isn't intimidated by thugs like Brookwood and Harlow. I want to understand what's going on, and I hope you will tell me. But for the moment, we should return to the castle. Professor Weasley will certainly hear about the troll attack soon if she hasn't already. I don't want her to worry. We must return to Camera for night, access the map. Okay. Okay. I love how you don't gotta walk every single place. You think y'all the bush though? See, no, we that's why see y'all take the easy way out. That's what Slytherin do. Y'all don't do things how you're supposed to. Welcome to Hogs Mead. Quest is done, fellas. Let's see what's on the agenda next. Quest. Gone the wrong way. Regroup with Professor Fig. Oh, that's my guy. I gotta tell him about everything that happened. All right, I think we made some progress. We got some new gloves. Oh, these are locked. It make my defense better though. Um, is there a way we can like upgrade these things? See, like hood on. Oh, there it is. That's what I've been wanting. That's what I've been wanting, bro. That's what I've been wanting. <laughs> That's what I've been wanting, bro. Come on! Drip! 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 Come on! What is this? Nah, I don't want that Batman shit. Go around. Bro, we... Oh my god, we are so fresh right now. I ain't gonna stand. Yeah, yeah. Now we just need some kicks, bro. I don't know. That, oh, you can't wear shoes on here, but that's fine. He dripped out, bro. Let's go, man. Thank y'all for tuning in. Thank y'all for watching. I'll be back probably later on um, with another episode. Make sure y'all like and subscribe. Um, get y'all notifications up, man, so y'all could tune in and see what else we go in the story. It was great meeting y'all. Uh, Leon, thank you, uh, thank you for coming in the stream. You know what I'm saying? Bring whoever you brought, man. It's always great to talk to you and catch up with you, man. Um, we gotta run something together, man. Get a little joint stream, man. Um, shout out to Raz Pudis for joining. Shout out to, uh, Nilo K7. Shout out to... Um, Marks, who else we got in here? Shout out to Kareeb, A Man Dre, Cleve, C Henny, um, Sammy Moman, Soul, Mr. Gamer. All y'all, man, I appreciate all y'all, man. I hope y'all stay tuned and come in the stream and come watch me play some other stuff, man, and chat with me, bro. It's pretty cool to do this type of thing. I ain't never really had that many people like join all at the same time. It's kind of been more sporadic. But uh, 
I do appreciate this for real. It's one of my favorite hobbies and I want to build like a, a platform and a community for everyone to be, you know, sharing their own type of things and all that stuff and experience and helping each other out, you know, play games and get get each other out there. I don't know what everyone's goal is, but I'm always here to provide a positive, you know, a positive community, a positive place. But um, shout out to all y'all, man. Make sure y'all like and subscribe one more time. And uh, Book Squad, we out this thing.